Erskine Bowles and Alan Simpson, a Democrat, a Republican. They've shown America the way, the way out of our difficulties for generations to come. President Obama appointed these two brilliant Washington players to come up with a plan to make America healthy and wise, while letting people like me get wealthier and wealthier and wealthier. And their plan is really brilliant. It's straight out of Willie Sutton's playbook. For those of you who don't know who Willie Sutton is, Willie Sutton liked to rob banks. And when they finally caught him, they asked him, why banks? And he said, because that's where the money is. So that's where they're going, where the money is. They want to tap into the Social Security surplus and the ongoing stream of Social Security taxes, all that money that the people have been putting into the program for decades and will keep paying into it, to siphon off that cash for other things, like tax cuts for the wealthy. Yeah, job creators. Every other area of government runs in a deficit. There's no money to pay us through those avenues, and we certainly aren't going to pay higher taxes. But Social Security has a surplus and we can spend that money better than grandma can. It's only a matter of time before the Washington politicians put grandma on a diet. That Social Security check is going to shrink and shrink and shrink. So, it doesn't take a brain surgeon to figure out how to make even more money out of this whole situation. And I, being the benevolent soul that I am, am going to give you a tip. Buy cat food stock. Fancy Feast, Meow Mix, Whiskas, Alley Cat, it really doesn't matter. All cat food stock is going to go through the roof because, plain and simple, a vast new market is going to be created. That's all Grandma is going to be able to afford to eat when Simpson and Bowles gets through with Social Security. Me, ow. <laughs>